The first time I got my period. 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 I think I was really young because at nine I, I was terrified. I just didn't know what to do. So I didn't tell anybody. I, I basically just kept it to myself for like a year. Even my mom didn't know that, that I had gotten my periods. All I remember is having to explain to my teacher that I needed to go to the washroom about two, three times in the same period um, of a lesson. You remember how you used to have like 40 minute lessons? I needed to go to the washroom like two, three times because I was so unsure of, of it showing on my dress. I was like, I'd seen it happen to, because I was in a girl's boarding school. I was so afraid of it showing on my dress. So it was like, I had to go check every time the fear <laughs> that was there. I can't explain. I just felt some pains on my stomach. I didn't know what was happening. But when I went to the toilet, uh, I found some blood stains on my panty. It was so uncomfortable, I felt so bad, but I was ready for it. The first time, I was like, I felt some pain in my tummy, so I was like, am I sick? What's happening? So I went and talked to the teacher, I said, I think I'm not feeling well. So she told me to explain how I was feeling. Then. Since I'm sure she's been talked to by other girls before, she was like, go to the toilet and tell me if you see anything. So when I went to the toilet is when I saw, hmm, something might be happening. And that's when I found out I had started my period. I'd never quite really known someone who had had her periods from my school. I was in a mixed boarding school, so no prior information. I was so anxious. I just felt like I didn't know what to do. It was the most scariest time of my life. I just remember going to my mom's shop. There was a shop she used to work at at the mall. And I was just so quiet, you know. And my mom's like, what's wrong with you? And I'm like, I found blood in my panties. And so I remember her getting a pack of pads and then she just gave them to me. She's like, you're a woman now. I was the youngest in my class and I think I was the last one to get periods. So I felt good. The three words I'd use to describe my periods are erratic, uncomfortable, and downright unnecessary. <laughs> <laughs> the three words I would use to describe my periods are painless, heavy, and messy. The three words I would use to describe my periods are discomfort, pain, and that three words I would use to describe my period are expensive, inconveniencing, and uncomfortable. When I get my period, I get super like extra sleepy. Um, and thank God I don't really get cramps like most other people. I just get very hungry. So I have a big appetite and, and I like, you know, I sleep a lot. So now that I'm a grown up, um, the three words I'd use to describe them, painful, extremely expensive and third still weird you still don't get used to your period but you learn to live with it